Good afternoon. I would like to welcome parents and friends of the college community, along with staff and students, to the 2021 Semester 2 College Values Awards Ceremony. Staff, students, special guests, and friends of Patterson River Secondary College, I would like to acknowledge the traditional custodians of this land, the Bunurong people, and pay our respects to their elders, both past, present, and future of the Kulin Nation, for they hold the memories, the traditions, the culture and hopes of Aboriginal Australia. Today's ceremony is to celebrate the achievements of student in relation to our four college, to our four core values at the college, persistence, excellence, community and respect. Students have been nominated these awards by their classroom teachers and also through their commitment to extracurricular activities beyond the classroom. We will be also be acknowledging our subject ducks from each subject in year eight that has occurred this year. It is important that we as a college recognize the efforts of many students from semester two in front of our school community. I would now like to welcome our college principal, Mr. Daniel Dew to the stage. Uh, thank you, Jack and Ali. And good afternoon, everybody. Uh, welcome to our students that are here uh, present and our staff members, but of course also to our parents, carers and friends of the college who are joining us uh, online, either live uh, through the stream that we have running this afternoon or are watching at a later date uh, via a recording. Um, I'm so proud uh, to be here as a college principal at the end of this semester, uh, not only of our students uh, that uh, for their efforts that they have uh, been able to put towards their studies uh, this year, but collectively for our whole school community. Um, I am proud uh, for the way in which we have been able to tackle uh, the challenges that we've faced uh, throughout this semester. Um, challenges that were a little bit unexpected. I think it was uh, at our semester one uh, award ceremony when uh, there were just a few cases bubbling around and I think we were in this assembly and uh, there was uh, just announced zero cases and it looked like uh, we were going to have a clean run at semester two and then things quickly changed overnight. Um, and so we certainly didn't have the semester uh, that we expected uh, when we went into that snap lockdown. But uh, despite all of those challenges, our school community rallied together and our students demonstrated their developing character through uh, the school values of persistence, excellence, community and respect. These values represent a wide range of competencies, each of which are essential to leading a successful life. One that is happy, healthy and fulfilled. Excluding uh, the community awards, each of the awards are given to one to two students per class by the classroom teacher. That means that each of these awards is extremely difficult to obtain and prestigious. The first type of award is a persistence award. These are awarded to students for continually striving to achieve their personal best. Or in some cases, students who have demonstrated significant improvement over the course of the semester. This award is about setting goals and being determined, about learning from mistakes and listening to feedback. The next type of award is an excellence award. These are awarded to students who have achieved academic results that place them at the top or near top of the class. For many students, it's often an area or subject that comes easier to them than others, uh, and often an area of passion for them that may one day turn into a career path. The third type of award is a respect award. These awards go to students who not only respect themselves and their own learning, but look out and advocate for their classmates. They listen to others and ensure that the learning environment is collaborative and high performing. The last type of award is a community award. And unfortunately, the nature of the semester that we've had means that we have less community awards than what we normally would have. But I remember back fondly to our semester one uh, award ceremony and the way in which uh, our year eight students here had committed to uh, a whole range of activities uh, and fundraising and all sorts of things happening within our school community, uh, whether that be on site or out in the community. Today, we will also be awarding a ducks to a student in each subject. Teachers have assessed student results across all classes to determine the ducks for each subject at year eight. And then there will be a ducks for each learning area awarded at presentation night next week. For each of our students here, I know that it has not been a settled start to your secondary years uh, due to the pandemic. In fact, we were just uh, 
talking before, it took us a little bit of time for the year rates to come in and sort of uh, understand what was going on. And I was talking to Ali and Jack and we determined that there's only been once before that you guys have actually come in here for a normal school values award ceremony. Uh, I think last year we, I came around to classes and handed out the awards to each of you. Uh, then we've had uh, earlier this year where you walked in and then walked out after uh, the, the awards. So it was only semester two last year where we've run the assembly in this format. And I, I can't wait uh, to, to be able to have our parents, carers and friends of the college join us next year uh, for our next School Values Awards here on site because it's always a highlight being able to share these achievements uh, with other members of our school community. Um, I'm sure that you're all excited about entering Year 9. It's certainly been nice to see the, the way that, that students are sort of have a bit of a bounce in their step and energise this week. Uh, and I'm sure that the students will um, be putting their absolute best foot forward and making uh, the most of the opportunities next year. All the learning activities, electives, camps and excursions that are on to offer as part of our Year 9 program. Finally, congratulations and well done to all of the students who are about to receive an award today. Thank you. This year so far has been a fantastic experience for the year eights. We have been able to pick some electives that we enjoy. This includes woodwork, rising stars, cooking, and much more. Many year eight students are involved in the college production of Matilda the Musical, which was performed in term two. From lead roles, dancers, to members of the ensemble, they all did a wonderful job, and it will be a memory they will have forever. The swimming and athletics carnivals allowed the Year 8 sporty students to do very well in. We have also had students go out and represent the college in a variety of different inter-school sports. We hope the rest of the year is just as exciting. It is an honour to be recognised for the efforts in Semester 2 and I would now like to ask Ms Clois to present the Year 8 awards. Thank you to Ali and Jack. It's lovely to see you both be able to take on a little bit of your leadership role, which has been a bit limited. Um, year 8, it's just a really great pleasure to be here this afternoon to be able to present awards to those of you who really demonstrated our school values during a difficult semester too. And so really well done to all of you that are standing there at the moment waiting for awards. So to start with from 8A, we have Adelaide Barnard in recognition for excellence in bookmaking and illustration. Ashlyn Burley for excellence in English and German, persistence in humanities and respect in learning for now. Veronica Daly for persistence in art. Oakley Fisher for persistence in food studies. Ali Harding is recognised for excellence in humanities and learning for now, for persistence in English and science, and for respect in design technology and food studies. Storm Muir is acknowledged for excellence in design technology, in drama, in maths and in science, for persistence in learning for now and for respect in humanities and physical education. William Rowley is acknowledged for persistence in physical education and respect in science. Aidan Smith, acknowledged for excellence in food studies and in physical education, persistence in maths and respect in art, English and German. Scarlett Smith, for excellence in art, persistence in design technology and respect in drama. And Bennett Withers is acknowledged for persistence in sport and recreation. Congratulations to our 8A students. From 8B, I'd like to acknowledge the following students. Salome Katora for excellence in art and physical education, persistence in bookmaking and illustration, 
humanities and information technology and respect in English, music and science. Amanda De Silva for persistence in science and respect in learning for now. Vicky Jeb Sarkis for excellence in design technology and edible gifts. Torrance Harper, excellence in learning for now, persistence in German and physical education and respect in information technology, master chef and music. Lachlan Hodson, for persistence in coding and game development. Nate Hughes, respect in humanities. Abby Jones, for excellence in rising stars. Justine Lung, for excellence in German and persistence in maths. Keely McLaughlin, excellence in music and science persistence in English and learning for now, and respect in art, design technology, German and maths. Tatva Patel, excellence in robot challenges and persistence in art. Zoe Roberts O'Connor, persistence in design technology, music and rising stars. Lachlan Van Riel, excellence in retro metal. And Melissa Zong, excellence in English, humanities, information technology and maths and respect in physical education. To all of our 8B students, congratulations. From 8C, Miley Costa Howard, Persistence in Individualised Project Art. Jayla Gilpin, Persistence in German and Science and Respect in Physical Education. Juliet Grady, Persistence in Maths and Respect in Design Technology. Charlie Lang, Persistence in Drama. Peter Martin, Persistence in Food Studies. Campbell Prime, for Excellence in Physical Education, Persistence in Design Technology and Respect in Food Studies and Science. Alana Skinner, Excellence in Design Technology, Drama, English, Excel Sport, German, Learning for Now and Maths and persistence in physical education. Sky Sutton, excellence in art, persistence in English, respect in bookmaking and illustration, drama, learning for now and maths. William Vincent, for respect in robot challenges. Jason Weston, persistence in robot challenges and respect in German. I'd also like to acknowledge Kasha Evans, who's not here today. Kasha has been acknowledged for excellence in food studies and physical education, persistence in Excel sport and learning for now, and respect in English. Congratulations to all of our 8C students. From 8D, we have Cooper Bromley, who's acknowledged for persistence in physical education, respect in art and learning for now. Amaya Galloway, for excellence in design technology, learning for now and master chef, persistence in art, English and humanities, and respect in information technology and maths. Zachary Kalajarinas, for respect in German. Fern McGurr for 
excellence in art, English, humanities, information technology, maths and physical education, and persistence in German, learning for now, MasterChef and music. Isabel Rupp Coleman for excellence in make it with timber and music and persistence in maths and respect in design technology and humanities. I do apologize, Oscar. Oscar McGuinnesskin for respect in English. Callum Songoro for respect in retro metal. Dylan Taylor for persistence in information technology. James Thompson for persistence in design technology. And Alana Upson for excellence in German and respect in music. To all of our 8D students, congratulations on those awards. Okay, from A to E, Pauline Alenik, you have been um, acknowledged for your respect in music. Aidan Bowen, excellence in music and science and persistence in design technology and English. Tia Costa Howard, for excellence in art and persistence in music. Lachlan Fulton, excellence in physical education and respect in sports and recreation. Ashley Honeybell, for respect in information technology. Wilbur Hunter, excellence in design technology and respect in MasterChef. Tegan Jones, for excellence in MasterChef and for respect in German humanities, maths, and physical education. Felicia Kumar for respect in English. Jack O'Connor for excellence in English, humanities, and maths, and persistence in make it with timber and science. Erin Price, persistence in humanities and maths. Sienna Sheed for excellence in German, learning for now and music, persistence in art, information technology and retro metal, respect in design technology and a community recognition for leading, coaching and organising the Patterson River Secondary College Junior Aerobics Team. Phoenix Symphendorfer Sinf for excellence in information technology. Alexandra Tasker for respect in art. Benjamin Ward for persistence in learning for now and respect in science. And I'd also like to acknowledge two students who are not here. So Neve Cornell for respect in edible gifts and learning for now. And Abby Colpin Watson for excellence in sport and recreation and persistence in German and physical education. Really big congratulations to our students in 8E. Students from 8F, Emmett Carbus for respect in learning for now and in rising stars. Chase Grondman for respect in design technology. Avi Jackson for excellence in art, 
design technology, learning for now, maths and science, and persistence in retro metal and respect in drama, English and German. Lily Millwood for respect in maths. Caleb Morrison, excellence in physical education. Tom Murphy, excellence in drama, English and German, persistence in design technology and respect in physical education. Tom Patterson, persistence in phys physical education and respect in art and passport sport. Sarah Williams Fletcher, persistence in art, English, German, learning for now, maths and science. And Keishu Yip, for respect in coding and game development and in science. Congratulations to our students from ADF. From HE, Austin Byrne, excellence in gaming, coding and game development, sorry, and respect in humanities. Teresa Highland for persistence in physical education. Larissa Kane, persistence in German and learning for now and respect in individualized art. Rory Lance, for persistence in design technology and learning for now and respect in physical education. Millie Loveridge for persistence in information technology. Matthew McCauley, excellence in drama and physical education, persistence in passport sports and respect in learning for now. Jordan Miller, persistence in art and respect in information technology. Ronan Mulholland for persistence in science. Christian Orienza for respect in design technology. Luca Perry, persistence in humanities and passport sport and respect in English. Diane Sayers for excellence in learning for now. Julia Talbot, excellence in design technology, German, information technology and science, persistence in English and MasterChef and respect in drama. Caden Tenster, excellence in humanities, persistence in drama, respect in art, German, learning for now and science. Jordan Williams, excellence in art, edible gifts, English and learning for now. And Phoebe Winrow for persistence in edible gifts. And congratulations to our HE students. Okay, from 8H, Ania Apaji, excellence in design technology, English, food studies, learning for now, maths and science, persistence in humanities and respect in physical education. Selena Barutas for persistence in learning for now. Lachlan Barty, excellence in food studies, humanities, learning for now and passport sport, persistence in physical education and science and respect in English. Chloe Collins, 
persistence in food studies, and respect in design technology, humanities, learning for now, and maths. Cooper Foley for persistence in food studies. Jackson Foreman, respect in food studies and learning for now. Isabel Kelly, respect in music. Aaron Roberts, persistence in design technology, English, German, learning for now and maths. Blake Rouget for respect in food studies and science. Grace Talamelli for respect in art. And I'd also like to acknowledge Taj McGuinness, who's not with us today, but he has been acknowledged for excellence in physical education. So congratulations to our students from 8H. From 8i, we have Liam Ali for persistence in information technology and respect also in information technology. Hannah Dargan for excellence in individualized project art and science, persistence in German and learning for now and respect in humanities and maths. Hannah Griffiths for respect in German. Belle Hingert for excellence in design technology, English, maths, music, and science. Alicia McKenzie for respect in art. Jethro Russell for excellence in German, humanities, and learning for now. Persistence in art, maths, physical education, and science, and respect in English. Bailey Thompson for persistence in design technology and respect in learning for now and physical education. And Rick Weppner for excellence in physical education. In addition, I'd like to acknowledge some students who aren't here from 8i, Riley Donaldson for persistence in humanities, Matilda Martins for excellence in art, persistence in music, and respect in Make It With Timber and Science, and Levi Sanger for excellence in information technology and respect in design technology. Congratulations to our 8i students. And our students from 8J, Tessa Cumming, you're acknowledged for persistence in art. Thomas Foote for excellence in English and learning for now, persistence in design technology and food studies and respect in humanities. Axel Jager for persistence in learning for now and respect in food studies. Kiralee Karp for persistence in maths. Roshan Lama for respect in physical education. Blake May for persistence in physical education. Willem Thompson for excellence in design technology and physical education. Persistence in English food studies humanities and music, and respect in art and Excel sport. And Grace Tuatoko Newman for excellence in food studies and humanities, persistence in German, and respect in design technology, English, learning for now, maths and music. Congratulations, 8J students. 
And thank you, Year 8s. Today, we are also acknowledging our subject ducks. These students are the top students for each subject that has been undertaken in 2021. To receive this award, students need to be exceeding in their academic outcomes, have exceptional attendance, be organized with their learning, and also be consistently exhibiting our four college values. Only one student per subject has been selected for this award across the whole year. Therefore, if you receive one today, you should be extremely proud of your achievements in, the, in that subject. I would like to ask Mr. Cashmore and Mr. Dew to present these awards. Thank you, Jack, and thank you, Ali. Um, I just want to reiterate what Ms. Clowes said. Super proud of this group of year eights uh, to get through, I guess, almost two years of remote learning last year and then this year. Um, it's fantastic to see so many award winners. So I'm here to award the ducks for each subject. First up, we have Alana Skinner, the ducks of German. I'll read everyone's names out. And once we've got everyone, we might give a round of applause at the end, please. Ali Tasker, Rising Stars. Benjamin Ward, Coding and Game Development. Fern McGurr, MasterChef. Grace Tuatoku Newman, Retro Medal. Isabel Rupp Coleman, Make It With Timber. Jack O'Connor, English, Humanities, Mathematics and Science. Jordan Williams, Food Studies and Edible Gifts. And for the first round, Julia Talbot for Learning For Now. We might give this first half of award recipients a round of applause, please. You can all grab a seat, thank you. Continuing on, we have Justine Leung for Design Technology. Kai Shu Yip, Sport and Recreation. Keely McLaughlin, Performing Arts Music. Lockie Fulton, Passport Sports. Ollie Gleason, Physical Education. Peter Martin, Robot Challenges. Phoenix Simfendorfer, Information Technology and Excel Sport. Salome Katora, Individual Art Project, Bookmaking and Illustration and Visual Art. And Tegan Jones, Performing Arts Drama. And a big round of applause, please, for our award recipients. And I'd just like to pass it back to Ali and Jack to take us out. Thank you. Some of the students who have received awards today may also receive learning area ducks at our presentation night next week. This is the next level in awards and is presented to one student from the whole cohort per learning area. Look out for your invitation to this special night on Compass. Thank you very much for your participation in today's ceremony. 
we encourage all students to strive for their own personal best in Step Up and beyond. Work really hard in all of your subjects. Take pride in your work and efforts. Seek feedback to help you improve and make sure you take advantage of all learning opportunities in the classroom and beyond. I would now like to ask Mr. Ju back to the stage to formally close the ceremony. Uh, thank you, Ellie and Jack. Uh, before I get through to closing things formally, can we please hear it for our Master of Ceremonies here today, please? Ellie and Jack did a fantastic job. Uh, well done to all of our award recipients today. Uh, I'm really proud of your achievements, but collectively proud, as I mentioned before, of our whole school community, um, not just our award recipients today, but everybody, the fact that we're here after a rocky road through semester two to be here uh, engaged and committed to learning is an outstanding job. Um, also, it's really nice to sort of remind ourselves as uh, was uh, when Jack and Ali went through the, all the marvellous things that actually have happened this year. It's, it's pretty easy for us to put the lens of uh, the lockdown through semester two uh, onto the whole year. And, and in fact, over the whole two years uh, that each of you have been in high school so far, there's been so many wonderful opportunities. Um, and even this year, being able to do things like productions and so on have been absolutely fantastic. And I'm so pleased to see the numbers of year eights going to year nine that have been involved in all of those sorts of activities. Uh, and as I mentioned before as well, I'm sure that you will all make the most of the wonderful opportunities that you have as part of the year nine program. Uh, to the parents, uh, carers and friends of the college who have joined us online, uh, thank you for uh, your shared commitment to learning and working in partnership with us here at uh, the college. I hope you have a safe uh, and Merry Christmas and a good break uh, and really look forward to welcoming you into our uh, college here for future award ceremonies. Uh, and to the students, well done. I'm really proud of you. Uh, enjoy your break and I will see everybody in the new year. Thank you.